Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Tyrone back with Tech Life. And in this video, I have a network update for you guys from Verizon. And this is a big one. So make sure you guys stay tuned. So there's been confusion all over the place about this additional 10 billion from Verizon. Some have said it's 10 billion per year. Some have said it's a fixed number that's split between the three years. And it's actually, it's actually none of those. The way it was explained to me, as you see here in this tweet, and this is not from an analyst or a investor. This is from Verizon's CEO of the consumer group, Ronan Dunn. This is directly from the horse's mouth, so to speak. He made it very clear to me that that $10 billion over three years is not a fixed split number per year. This means that the Verizon CTO has the green light to spend that $10 billion however fast he can deploy the equipment. So just to put this in perspective, and what I'm, what I'm about to say is highly unlikely, it's, it's unreal for that matter. But if he could spend or if he could deploy equipment in 2021 that equals 10 billion, he has the green light to do so. And let me be very clear, that's unreal. That's likely not not going to happen. That's just that's it's unreal. It's impossible. But if he could, he has the green light to spend that 10 billion this year. So I'm going to go on record. I'm going to say this for me. Verizon crushes that 100 million by March next year. I think they get to 120, 130. They start out the gates a bit slow, but they quickly ramp up. Remember, there's a permit backlog on some sites, very, very, very small sites. Are they going to actually need those permits? It's, it's likely people that have sites on properties that belong to them. That's that's like because they have to they need, you know, permission to enter the property and all that stuff. But most sites, they do not need permits. That's been agreed upon by the FCC. If LTE is pre-existing, Verizon can go to the site and upgrade it to 5G, no permit needed. So they start out the gate slow. Again, they got to get the you know, they got to get everything, all the ducks lined up. They got to get the, the equipment ready. They. You know, they got to get the manufacturers on board and then they got to go attack. And I think they do that faster. I predict they do it two times faster than even T-Mobile. Why? Because they have a dedicated fund towards that. That's $10 billion. Again, they are still going to spend their normal range of $17.5 to $18.5 billion for this year. They're still spending that. There's no change in it. They're just adding $10 billion to it. And that $10 billion over three years can be spent as fast as the equipment can be possibly deployed. So just let that sink in. That's massive. Yes, it's 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 a cash infusion. Yes, I mean, it's, this is pretty much Verizon cash infusion their own company. That's how much money they got. So be anticipating this to be very similar to the XLTE rollout, if you remember that rollout. That was the first time Verizon got AWS Spectrum on its network and it was deployed in clusters. So that's that leads me to my next point. He confirmed that none of this will be on until December. So they're waiting until it's actually cleared, which is fine because they are going to deploy equipment ahead of time and launching clusters with a flip of a switch. Boom. It'll go from off to on and then it's on air. So they're going to do the same. They did the same thing with XLTE. There's no change in this company. They're going with what works and what they know. They did it the exact same way. They deployed it in clusters. And they're doing it with C-Band. So be expecting this in the top 46 markets. It's going to be all over Manhattan. It's going to be all. It's going to be in some of the boroughs. Of course, not everywhere in the boroughs. Chicago's. The, I mean, the top 46 is going to be heavily deployed starting this year in December. There's going to be some more coming from December to March, but they'll get there. Trust me, they will get there because they have their eyes set on a goal. And then the last point that was made 
a lot of people were kind of back and forth. Is millimeter wave slowing down? Is it is it temporarily slowing down? Are they picking up? He confirmed that no, we're we're maintaining our pace. They did not give a time frame because you really can't put a time frame on it. But in all urban markets, they want 50% of the data traffic to come from millimeter wave. Just let that sink in as well. That means they have to rapidly, I mean, extensively densify the network to make that happen. We're talking the repeaters. That also means indoor solutions, small cells, uh, repeaters indoors, structure closer to the building. So they're definitely building towards that now. They've been doing it. I mean, 14,000 nodes are coming this year. And that'll likely just continue next year and the year after because their spending levels have not changed. They're maintaining the same. That means fiber is being deployed to the sites. And this it's not any fiber. It's aggressive, good fiber, the best of the best. And I'm even hearing they're working on a better fiber solution for a C-band. And they did state that that 50% of their tower, entire nationwide tower grid is going to have their fiber on it. So this is massive. This is just an update that I wanted to push out to you guys this evening so you guys could kind of decipher it, break it down. This is massive. I'm glad this was cleared up so now you guys know. Again, follow the Twitter so you guys are up to date on these types of replies and, and, and tweets as I put them out. So if you have been on the channel or you're new to the channel and you have not yet liked, share, subscribed, make sure you do so. Hit the notification bell so you are notified when I do upload the content. Make sure to follow the social media outlets for more updates and interactions. Thanks again for watching. This is Tyrone with Tech Life, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.